Chlordiaspoxide is a sedative, hypnotic drug and benzodiazepine. Chlordiaspoxide was the first benzodiazepine to be synthesized and the discovery of chlordiaspoxide was by pure chance. Chlordiaspoxide and other benzodiazepines were initially accepted with widespread public approval but were followed with widespread public disapproval and recommendations for more restrictive medical guidelines for its use. Chlordiaspoxide has a medium to long half-life but its active metabolite has a very long half-life. The drug has amnestic, anticonvulsant, anxiolytic, hypnotic and skeletal muscle relaxant properties. Medical uses, chlordiaspoxide is indicated for the short term, 2 to 4 weeks, treatment of anxiety that is severe and disabling or subjecting the person to unacceptable distress. It is also indicated as a treatment for the management of acute alcohol withdrawal syndrome. When combined with amitriptyline, Known as Limbitrol, it can be used to treat new daily persistent headache disorder. Contraindications Use of chlordiaspoxide should be avoided in individuals with the following conditions myasthenia gravis acute intoxication with alcohol, narcotics, or other psychoactive substances, ataxia, severe hypoventilation, acute narrow angle glaucoma, severe liver deficiencies. Hepatitis and liver cirrhosis decrease elimination by a factor of 2 severe sleep apnea hypersensitivity or allergy to any drug in the benzodiazepine class. Chlordiaspoxide is generally considered an inappropriate benzodiazepine for the elderly due to its long elimination half-life and the risks of accumulation. Benzodiazepines require special precaution if used in the elderly. Pregnancy, children, alcohol or drug dependent individuals, and individuals with comorbid psychiatric disorders. Pregnancy The research into the safety of benzodiazepines during pregnancy is limited, and it is recommended that use of benzodiazepines during pregnancy should be based on whether the benefits outweigh the risks. If chlordiaspoxide is used during pregnancy the risks can be reduced via using the lowest effective dose and for the shortest time possible. Benzodiazepines should generally be avoided during the first trimester of pregnancy. Chlordiaspoxide and diaspam are considered to be among the safer benzodiazepines to use during pregnancy in comparison to other benzodiazepines. Possible adverse effects from benzodiazepine use during pregnancy include, abortion, malformation, intrauterine growth retardation, functional deficits, carcinogenesis and mutagenesis. Caution is also advised during breastfeeding as chlordiaspoxide passes into breast milk. Side effects, common side effects of chlordiaspoxide include, confusion constipation drowsiness fainting altered sex drive liver problems lack of muscle coordination minor menstrual irregularities nausea skin rash or eruptions swelling due to fluid retention yellow eyes and skin chlordiaspoxide in laboratory mice studies impairs latent learning benzodiazepines impair learning and memory via their action on benzodiazepine receptors which causes a dysfunction in the cholinergic neuronal system in mice. It was later found that scopolamine impairment in learning was caused by an increase in benzodiazepine GABA activity, and that benzodiazepines were not associated with the cholinergic system. In tests of various benzodiazepine compounds, Chlordiaspoxide was found to cause the most profound reduction in the turnover of 5-HT, serotonin, in rats. Serotonin is closely involved in regulating mood and may be one of the causes of feelings of depression in rats using chlordiaspoxide or other benzodiazepines. Tolerance and Dependence Tolerance Chronic Use of Benzodiazepines such as chlordiaspoxide, leads to the development of tolerance, 
with a decrease in number of benzodiazepine binding sites in mouse forebrain. The Committee of Review of Medicines, who carried out an extensive review of benzodiazepines including chlordiazepoxide, found, and were in agreement with the Institute of Medicine, USA, and the conclusions of a study carried out by the White House Office of Drug Policy and the National Institute on Drug Abuse, USA, that there was little evidence that long-term use of benzodiazepines were beneficial in the treatment of insomnia due to the development of tolerance. Benzodiazepines tended to lose their sleep-promoting properties within 3 to 14 days of continuous use, and in the treatment of anxiety the committee found that there was little convincing evidence that benzodiazepines retained efficacy in the treatment of anxiety after four months continuous use due to the development of tolerance. Dependence Chlordiazepoxide can cause physical dependence in what is known as the benzodiazepine withdrawal syndrome. Withdrawal from chlordiazepoxide or other benzodiazepines often leads to withdrawal symptoms that are similar to those seen with alcohol and barbiturates. The higher the dose and the longer the drug is taken, the greater the risk of experiencing unpleasant withdrawal symptoms. Withdrawal symptoms can, however, occur at standard dosages and also after short-term use. Benzodiazepine treatment should be discontinued as soon as possible through a slow and gradual dose reduction regime. Chlordiazepoxide taken during pregnancy can cause a postnatal benzodiazepine withdrawal syndrome. Overdose See also, benzodiazepine overdose, an individual who has consumed excess chlordiazepoxide may display some of the following symptoms, somnolence. Difficulty staying awake Mental confusion Hypotension Hypoventilation Impaired motor functions Impaired reflexes Impaired coordination Impaired balance Dizziness Muscle weakness Coma In animal models, the oral median lethal dose of chlordiazepoxide is 537 mg slash kg. Chlordiazepoxide is a drug that is very frequently involved in drug intoxication including overdose. Chlordiazepoxide overdose is considered a medical emergency and, in general, requires the immediate attention of medical personnel. The antidote for an overdose of chlordiazepoxide, or any other benzodiazepine, is flumazenil. Interactions Some of the major interactions involving chlordiazepoxide are listed below. ACE inhibitors adrenergic neuron blockers, angiotensin II receptor antagonists, beta blockers, calcium channel blockers, clonidine, diazoxide, diuretics, hydrolazine, methyl dopa, minoxidil, nitrates, sodium nitroprusside, enhanced hypotensive effect alcohol, barbiturates, opiates, antihistamines, antipsychotics, increased sedative effect in combination with benzodiazepines. Cymtidine, metabolism of benzodiazepines inhibited by cymtidine, increased plasma concentration disulfiram, metabolism of benzodiazepines inhibited by disulfiram, increased sedative effects fluvoxamine, Plasma concentration of some benzodiazepines increased by fluvoxamine levodopa, benzodiazepines possibly antagonize effects of levodopamoxanidin, sedative effects possibly increased when benzodiazepines given with moxanidin olanzapine, increased risk of hypotension, bradycardia and respiratory depression when parenteral benzodiazepines given with intramuscular olanzapine phenetone, benzodiazepines possibly increase or decrease plasma concentration of phenetone rifampicin, metabolism of benzodiazepines possibly accelerated by rifampicin, reduced plasma concentration sodium oxybate, benzodiazepines enhance effects of sodium oxybate, Avoid concomitant use, pharmacology, 
Chlordias poxide acts on benzodiazepinal esteric sites that are part of the GABA receptor, ion channel complex and this results in an increased binding of the inhibitory neurotransmitter GABA to the GABA receptor thereby producing inhibitory effects on the central nervous system and body similar to the effects of other benzodiazepines. Chlordias poxide is an e-convulsant. There is preferential storage of chlordias poxide in some organs including the heart of the neonate. Absorption by any administered route and the risk of accumulation is significantly increased in the neonate. The withdrawal of chlordias poxide during pregnancy and breastfeeding is recommended, as chlordias poxide rapidly crosses the placenta and also is excreted in breast milk. Chlordias poxide also decreases prolactin release in rats. Benzodiazepines act via micromolar benzodiazepine binding sites as CA2 plus channel blockers and significantly inhibit depolarization sensitive calcium uptake in animal nerve terminal preparations. Chlordias poxide inhibits acetylcholine release in mouse hacampulse and aptosomes in vivo. This has been found by measuring sodium-dependent high-affinity choline uptake in vitro after pretreatment of the mice in vivo with chlordias poxide. This may play a role in chlordias poxide's anticonvulsant properties. Pharmacokinetics Chlordias poxide is a long-acting benzodiazepine drug. The half-life of chlordias poxide is 5 to 30 hours but has an active benzodiazepine metabolite, dismethyldiazepam, which has a half-life of 36 to 200 hours. The half-life of chlordias poxide increases significantly in the elderly, which may result in prolonged action as well as accumulation of the drug during repeated administration. Delayed body clearance of the long half-life active metabolite also occurs in those over 60 years of age, which further prolongs the effects of the drugs with additional accumulation after repeated dosing. History Chlordias poxide, initially called methaminodiase poxide, was the first benzodiazepine to be synthesized in the mid-1950s. Chlordias poxide was synthesized from work on a chemical dye, quinazolone 3 oxides. It was discovered by accident when in 1957 tests revealed that the compound had hypnotic, anxiolytic and muscle relaxant effects. Three years later chlordias poxide was marketed as a therapeutic benzodiazepine medication under the brand name Librium. Following chlordias poxide, in 1963 diaspam hit the market under the brand name Valium, and was followed by many further benzodiazepine compounds over the subsequent years and decades. In 1959 it was used by over 2,000 physicians and more than 20,000 patients. It was described as chemically and clinically different from any of the tranquilizers psychic energizers or other psychotherapeutic drugs now available. During studies, chlordias poxide induced muscle relaxation and a quieting effect on laboratory animals like mice, rats, cats, and dogs. Fear and aggression were eliminated in much smaller doses than those necessary to produce hypnosis. Chlordias poxide is similar to phenobarbital in its anticonvulsant properties. However, it lacks the hypnotic effects of barbiturates. Animal tests were conducted in the Boston Zoo and the San Diego Zoo. 42 hospital patients admitted for acute and chronic alcoholism, and various psychoses and neuroses were treated with chlordias poxide. In a majority of the patients, Anxiety, tension, and motor excitement were effectively reduced. The most positive results were observed among alcoholic patients. It was reported that ulcers and dermatologic problems, both of which involving emotional factors, were reduced by chlordias poxide. 
chlordias poxide enabled the treatment of emotional disturbances without a loss of mental acuity or alertness. It assisted persons burdened by compulsive behavior who, amongst other behaviors, felt compelled to count the slats on Venetian blinds upon entering a room. In 1963, approval for use was given to dye as PAM, Valium, a simplified version of chlordiazpoxide, primarily to counteract anxiety symptoms. Sleep-related problems were treated with nitrous PAM, Mogadon, which was introduced in 1965, Temiz Pam, Restoral, which was introduced in 1969, and Fleuras Pam, Dalmain, which was introduced in 1973. Recreational use see also, benzodiazepine drug misuse. In 1963, Carl F. Essig of the Addiction Research Center of the National Institute of Mental Health stated that meprobamate, gliadithamide, ethinamate, ethchlorovenol, Methyprilon and chlordiazpoxide as drugs whose usefulness can hardly be questioned. However, Essig labeled these newer products as drugs of addiction, like barbiturates, whose habit forming qualities were more widely known. He mentioned a 90 day study of chlordiazpoxide, which concluded that the automobile accident rate among 68 users was 10 times higher than normal. Participants' daily dosage ranged from 5 to 100 mg. Chlordiazpoxide is a drug of potential misuse and is frequently detected in urine samples of drug users who have not been prescribed the drug. Legal Status Internationally, chlordiazpoxide is a Schedule IV controlled drug under the Convention on Psychotropic Substances. Toxicity Animal Laboratory tests assessing the toxicity of chlordiazpoxide, nitrospam and diazepam on mice spermatozoa found that chlordiazpoxide produced toxicities in sperm including abnormalities involving both the shape and size of the sperm head. Nitrospam, however, caused more profound abnormalities than chlordiazpoxide. Availability Chlordiazpoxide is available in various dosage forms, alone or in combination with other drugs, worldwide. See also, Alcohol Withdrawal Syndrome Effects of Long-Term Benzodiazepine Use Benzodiazepine Withdrawal Syndrome Benzodiazepine Dependence Benzodiazepine